the situation of uh, lesbian, gays, bisexual, and transgender in Uganda is getting worse than it was in the last two years. There's a lot of crackdowns. Offices are being raided. Two of our offices are being shut down. Our workshops are being closed down. Uh, there's a lot of illegal arrests. Two have happened just early this year on the 1st of January. Uh, radio talk shows are being closed down as I speak today even. One was shut down because they do not want us to just have a voice. They want us to become invisible. Anyone who tries to address issues of human rights is a threat to our government. The Martin Enolds Award uh, has really made a big impact for my community. Uh, even if, of course, our government did not recognize it, uh, they're using it to attack our community. They're using it to, to, to bash myself because they feel it's a disgrace that I was awarded the Martin Enolds Award for Human Rights Defenders. It's protection for me, but uh, again, it made me vulnerable because uh, since in my country they, 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 they seem to think that homosexuality is just an, an a Western influence, and a Western import, so they thought that the West awarded their own. That's how, actually, if I'm to quote one politician who said that the West had to award their own because they don't believe homosexuality really exists in my country. But uh, it has made us stronger in the community and it has made us recognized um, by other human rights organizations around the world.